Opening round, heat number two has Tatiana Weston Webb taking on Carissa Moore and Island Vost. What a battle. This is the opening round. It's not a final, but we've got some big names that are worthy of winning this contest. Carissa Moore, world number one, representing Brazil, but raised on Kauai, is already up and got this wave during the break. This heat now is pretty stacked. See Tatiana having another look. Tatiana now running through the inside. Clean frontside arc, setting up the lip to hit. Drills it and hops out of there. So that might be a nice game plan. When you don't have priority, look for a wave where you can throw down a few turns. That made the difference for Caitlin Simmers in the previous heat. And then maybe waiting for priority. Look at this first carving maneuver of Tati straight up into the lip for that second one. So nice little two-turn combo. I like this, uh, that she's mixing it up. Nice carving maneuver there. As you can see, she really put the board on rail straight up into the lip for the second one. And you can see that wave just gurgling at the bottom there, so she's quickly out. They're kind of few and far between as the swell's coming and it's on its way. Here we go. Tatiana Weston Webb in the barrel. Look at that beautiful ride. Can she make it? He does. Comes out going for the big hack right over that dry reef on the inside, but comes on stuck. So you go back to Tati's wave. Yeah, nice little cover up there. Short barrel comes flying out, jams it there, but just comes unstuck. But I liked it. Little stall. She had both arms in the side of the wave there to slow herself down. Little bit of tube time. Comes out, looks to hammer this section here, puts the board on rail, but just falls off. Probably be kicking herself there a little bit, I think, because here we go. Replay of uh, Carissa. Carissa Moore. Looking comfortable. Let's add some reps out here. Oh, what a cool angle flick. Yeah, I love this uh, drone shot of Carissa. Getting a little bit of tube time there. I'm liking it. So maybe as that wind's turning a little bit more offshore, it's keeping these waves a little bit more open, grooming them a little bit more maybe. But Riss in the barrel on that last one. Beautiful technique again. Comes flying out. The defending world champ got her eighth world title last year when she upset this woman who was number one in the world last year. Really impressed with Carissa Moore going through her, the toughest loss of her entire career last September and going right into number one in the world, winning Pipeline to kick off the season. For sure. As she said, you know, sometimes you just got to go and have a crack because you don't know until you go. Island Vost, the 18-year-old wild card, takes off on her first wave in a CT jersey. What a big moment for the grommet. I'm sure she's uh, pretty happy to get the ball rolling. She didn't fall on that first wave. She's having a look here again. Late takeoff, wave spits behind Island and she kicks out. Another opportunity setting up for Tatiana Weston Webb. Driving, nice positioning deep in it, but she gets tangled up on her way out. It looked like a clear make for Weston Webb. But unfortunately, she won't get the score she was hoping for. Just got clipped on the exit. The emotional roller coaster was just to get back to compete for another season on the championship tour. She got there. She's back bigger and stronger, and she's <laughs> wearing that number one jersey, the yellow jersey again. That live action out the back. Tatiana Weston Webb picking off a wave with some size, but it wasn't really a one with a lot of scoring potential for what she was looking for. Went to CJ, cool late takeoff, controlling the rail is Carissa Moore, pulling up and under, but that section clamps on her. She did all the hard work, didn't say nice and round for the exit, and that was a tough one, because it's so technical. Gets up underneath, beautiful travel time, and just gets sucked up and over. We'll have a look here from this angle, she gets in. Great travel time there, but just gets sucked up. You can see how shallow that wave is getting there. Vahine coming up next against Steph Gilmore and Tyler Wright. Battling for this wave with priorities. Tatiana Weston Webb pulls in. She'll get the completion there in the barrel. Now laying down a beautiful carve and kicks out. Little tube to turn combination always looks great. Have a look at the replay straight up and under the hood there. Comes flying out and really lays into that turn there. Puts the board on rail and gets out of there for that dry reef. But I like the technique, just uh, straight into it off the takeoff. Shakes the braids, gets the hair out of the face. 
and really lays that board on rail. Love the spray too. And in these types of conditions, we've had quite a few buzzer beaters in history of this, this contest. Tati with some room. Third priority. So you're going to go down to some turns here. Big blast there on the forehand. Oh. Arcs it for a combination, but she'll be incomplete and get sucked over the falls. Here we go. Replay of Tati's. I love this turn straight up into the lip. Throwing so much spray. Really critical turn there. And you can see she comes out of that turn with a lot of speed. Puts the board on rail again and kind of brought it around a little bit. And now Career some more on an important ride, going for a little connection on the lip line. Arcs it down to the bottom, room for maybe another turn, and kind of ran out of time there. So she hops out. We haven't really seen a, turn, a wave just solely on turns, kind of go into that four range or beyond. You take another look here. Yeah, replay of uh, Riss's last wave. She kind of got caught up there on that first turn and sort of on the second one as well i mean maybe these boards are you know quite possibly made for barrels so it feels a bit different when you go to turns and kind of looked a little bit like that here we go live action island island boss the wild card trying to slow down showing a little frustration there yeah frustration from uh 18 year old yeah don't think it's going to be enough for carissa moore and now officially not enough Tatiana Weston Webb, 8.5 combined total. We'll move on to the quarterfinals. Carissa Moore and Island Voss, we reseeded in the elimination round.